This is KMTV 3 News Now. I'm Megan Hahn with 3 News Now. Here's a look at what's happening. The body of a 17-year-old Millard West High School senior was found Sunday near a creek at 192nd in Harrison. Around 2 Sunday afternoon, friends called local sheriffs after finding the body. According to the Millard West High School, the body is that of 17-year-old Blake McCoon. Sharpie County Sheriff's deputies would not confirm the identity tonight. The Sheriff's Office is continuing to investigate the circumstances around McCoon's death. Millard West High School said in a letter to parents they'll have counselors available at the school on Monday. A priest has been permanently removed from public ministry in the Omaha Archdiocese. The move was announced Sunday. Archbishop George Lucas removed Reverend Donald Cleary after the priest refused to contest allegations of sexual abuse. The allegations state Cleary abused a minor in the mid-1980s. The complaint says the abuse happened in Wayne, Nebraska, where Cleary served from 1986 to 1998. Last week, the Archdiocese was in an uproar when news of another priest, Father Francis Neely, had been accused of sexually assaulting a 21-year-old man in May. And I'm 3 News Now, weather alert meteorologist Audra Moore with this weather update. Monday morning off to a cool start. Temperatures in the low 40s, upper 30s. We will see the winds shifting though. They'll be out of the south for most of the day on Monday, which good news that along with the sunshine will help warm our temperatures up quite a bit. We're looking at 60 degrees or so by lunchtime and that warming continues as we head through the afternoon. Might see a few high thin clouds passing through from time to time, but most of us going to be awfully close to that 70 degree mark by the afternoon. The winds though still going to be a bit gusty, especially as that warm front comes through up to about 20, maybe even 30 miles per hour for some of those gusts with a cold front headed our way for Tuesday. We are still going to see those gusts continuing as we head into Tuesday afternoon. Keep in mind for the next couple days, temperatures will eventually drop after that cold front, upper 50s on Tuesday. And we're going to hang out in the 50s really through about Friday when we drop back down into the upper 40s. That continues into the weekend. We'll see a couple more chances for a few rain showers.